Today, I will reveal the IP address of that server where we found that huge base at the Berezino fire station. And I will also teach you what to do to stay on as long as possible before being kicked. So watch this right after the intro. We just destroyed This is the video in which I'll teach you how to get the most out of the space at the Berezino fire station and in the end of the video I will also reveal the uh, server IP so that you can join in yourself with your friends and uh, you know take whatever you can and delete the base basically. So what we tried is uh, we gathered 5-6 people and joined in simultaneously to keep those server owners busy because this is a necessary step. You have to know, as soon as they are not online on their own server, they will shut the server down. So you cannot join the server while they are not on. And if they are on, and the server is up, and you join, they will instantly kick you. So having more friends will keep them more busy and save you some time so you can actually go to the tents. And that brings us directly to our next very important step. You have to log in exactly in the base you do not have time to run towards the base so you have to be on another server log out directly in or around the uh, base and then you have to wait for a couple of minutes because you do not want to wait for the three minutes for server hopping you want the instant spawn to be in the base and start raiding if you wait for three minutes they will detect you while you're in the loop and they will kick you before you've even loaded so you will see nothing. So you need the instant spawn right at the base. Of course, they will um, ch see on the server list who's on and they will instantly see that you are not one of them and uh, they will kick you. To make this process a little longer and make it more difficult for them to detect that somebody is on, you could change your name to one of their names and I will show you their names so you can just rename yourself in in Daisy you don't have to change your um, steam name just in Daisy in the main menu you change your name to one of their names and that can give you time up to five minutes before you get detected that's how we did it so this is my last piece of advice for that And the way we did it was that we gathered, we went there twice. On the first day, um, we were five people, the United Russian Army, my two special friends, um, of course my uh, super soldier Ripper Beat, and Jake Miller was there. So we did do that, log in simultaneously, instant spawn directly in the uh, base, and Fun thing is they have actually been in there and we had to kill a guy, but as we had the same outfit, maybe this is another important thing you have to uh, think about, just wear something that you can recognize your whole team. In, in our case, we all look like the Electro Police Department. We have the gas masks, we have the police hats, and everybody who doesn't have it is obviously hostile and can be shot right away without further questions being asked. So we did that, but we, uh, we've seen that five people is not enough. It was obvious that they could easily handle five people and kick the kick us and then we have to relog and basically they gathered them in the base and they called their friends and in the end it was like five versus five. They had all the gear and we were just trying to log in. Not such a good idea. So on our next attempt, I gathered 12 people. Great people. And we did the same thing again and this time we uh, kept logging in and we have been so many people and wearing their names and things like that. So there was a point, we reached a point where they basically gave up for a while to kick us. Or maybe there's a limit on how many people can kick, I don't know, but we could stay in there for several minutes and loot like crazy. And this is how I would suggest you do it. So either you really gather 15 people and join in simultaneously, see, or... Uh, we just arranged another mega raid and I could lead that 
And then we can just go there again as a huge group. I mean, it's only a 30 slot server, but I guess there are five people. So we could go there actually with 25 people if you guys want to. I could lead you there. Because that it will take them forever to kick us all the time. And we could just go there, gear up. If everybody brings a police head, we know who we, who we are, how we look like. And this is how we could do... Uh, many more mega raids because I know at least two more servers with uh, Duper idiots that don't want to be friendly like those guys where we could go and uh, Just have fun with hostile people and take away what they have cheated themselves on So let me know about that in the comments So and what you're seeing in the video right now is um, me showing the group possible spots for them to log off so that they will spawn in the base I did distribute the masks to everybody, uh, I gave the masks, the black masks to the troops basically and the white masks to my sergeants. One sergeant was um, Rapperbeat, you know him, Rapperbeat Killer Beast, best soldier in DayZ. And the other sergeant was the clan leader of the UNMG clan, I guess you all remember that, where we blew up their base uh, with grenades. But now we're friends and... Uh, we want to help each other out in Daisy, and they helped me raiding that base. So, clan leader of the UNMG clan was the uh, squad leader in this raid. I got an SOD. Gotta be Yeah, you get kicked all the time. No, don't worry. They're busy kicking, but we're so many. We have good chances to to get stuff. I've not been kicked once yet. Yeah, that's you're good. so lucky. Fuck you. I got here. I got here. Yeah, you don't have to announce that every time. <coughs> no, but I'm who's the yeah. who's the first spawn in the base? Who's the first spawn? Hi. That's none of us. Check his name. Don't have the hat or mask. Kill him. Uh, tech ducks. That that's one of the enemies. Tectax is the enemy. So and now as promised, here we go with the server IP and the owner's names. Don't care too much about the server name because they keep changing that. Just type in the IP and whatever comes up, that is the server. And here you got a selection of four names. You can use any of those four. I know some more names like Chakur, Chakalaka and Pascal. But um, I think those four should be enough for you to to utilize. And um, they also keep moving that base around because they have been attacked so many times at this spot now that it might be possible that they moved it somewhere up the hill um, next to the big high school area. But don't worry about this. If you are interested in uh, starting another mega raid, then let me know in the comments who wants to uh, participate and then I will organize something. And if you like my video, please leave a like. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, and I know there are still a whole lot of people out there, please subscribe. It's worth it. Because I will do a whole lot of uh, more base raid videos with uh, even more mega raids. And if you want to be a part of this, please subscribe and add me on Steam.